and I am on my way to an IKEA event. Good morning, today is Friday, August 3rd, 2018, and I am on my way to an IKEA event. IKEA is hosting a free breakfast for teachers, so I am heading my way. It is 8.18, it's gonna take me a little bit to get there, and it starts at 9 a.m. So I wanna vlog about my experience. I don't know if I'll be going in the classroom today after IKEA. I will try to see if I have time to go because I do have a doctor's appointment this afternoon. So let's see where the day takes us. All right, see you there. All right, I just made it to Ikea and there's already a line of teachers waiting patiently at the door because they don't open until nine, which is in less than 15 minutes. So we're just gonna join them in line. So let's do this. checked in we got our free breakfast coupon and we also got a free bag whoa I am tangled a free bag and yeah let me show you what we're gonna have for breakfast As you can see they just had the raffle and now we're just walking through the showroom area the marketplace area and I'm actually at the cushion section and I'm trying to get covers for the cushions that I had in my classroom library without having to get new cushions so these covers right here are four dollars each so let me show you the colors that I picked out I'm trying to get one that is kind of like a golden yellow but this is what I have so far so right here I have two in blue for my blue house two in red two in green and two in black 
I want to see if I can get this color as well. I mean, it's not exactly the yellow that I have for the other house, but it's close enough. So if I can get it, that'll be awesome. And then I can already have things to cover my cushions so they can go with the overall color theme that I have going for this year. So yeah, I think these will look really good in my colorful Harry Potter theme for the school year. So I can't wait to see if I can get these. So here I go. Alright, so I just left Ikea. It is 1047. My doctor's appointment is not until 215, but if I leave around 1.30, I think that'll be fine. So I'm actually gonna go ahead and head to school to continue working on that one bulletin board. So I did end up buying my cushions like I showed you, but they couldn't find the golden yellow ones that I really wanted. So maybe today after I'm done with my doctor's appointment, I can go to the other Ikea that's a little bit south of this one and see if they have it there. I only need two and then my pillows will be complete and it'll kind of use the same colors that I'm using on the borders and also on the houses. So let me now get to school and maybe once I'm there, I'll show you the bag that they gave us for free, which is a little different from the one they gave us last year. And if I can show you the one they gave us last year, I can show you a comparison of those. All right, so let me get going and I'll see you when I get to school. Alright, I am now in my classroom. I totally got sidetracked once I parked because one of my friends was coming in with a whole bunch of things and I wanted to help her bring those to the classroom and then we had a really nice conversation. So I'm in my room now. It is about 10 minutes to 12. So I have about an hour and 40 minutes before I need to leave for my doctor's appointment. So I'm going to go ahead and tackle that corner bulletin board, the Hogwarts silhouette bulletin board and see if I can get that one finished and then if I'm ready, I'm going to replace the sky blue paper right here in the header bulletin board behind me into black so I can get that one done and complete. And maybe that's all I do for today. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and set up the camera on the tripod. Hopefully I did bring my tripod. I hope I did. Probably I took it out. I don't remember. I may have a little tripod and I'll do a speed through of me changing that bulletin board border and finishing up that one. All right, so here you go. As you can see from behind me, I quite didn't finish because I ran out of border. Go figure, I used pretty much the whole package. I just have 
two little pieces left. So I'm just gonna pick up a brand new pack of black sparkly border so I can finish this off. But check out how awesome this is coming together. So here it is. And I really love how this is coming together with the white on the bottom and the black sparkly border on top. I mean, if you just look at it this way, that is a completed part right there. That's how it's gonna look ultimately when it's all completed, but no problem. Now I know that on Monday, I need to come prepared, if I am coming on Monday, with enough border to finish this off. And I didn't get a chance to finish this board yet because I had two of my friends come in and we started chatting and you know how it gets. We chat, chat, chat and the work stops, but it's okay because it was good to catch up with them and find out about how their summer went. And I also helped one of them out with a couple of my snack containers from Dollar Tree for her sons, so it's all good. All right, so I'm really happy with how this is coming out. I wanted to quickly show you what we got from Ikea. So this is the cute bag that you sort of got a glimpse from. And inside, they gave us this very sturdy magazine kind of container made out of cardboard. And this was, I believe, $1.99. They had it on clearance when we went to the showroom or the marketplace. And in here, they also gave us this little box which i'm gonna open it right now one of the other teachers opened hers and she said it was like a whole bunch of like note cards i think inside this is a little like box made out of cardboard and let me see it comes out i'm trying to do this with one hand this is very interesting okay so it's like a box within a box it's a little bit there okay i think i'm gonna have to put you all down yeah, let me put you down so I can use my two hands. All right, so they were actually kind of like nesting boxes. So these are boxes for you to put, I guess, pens and accessories in. So let me put them here so you can kind of see them. So you have kind of like a big box, medium, and then a little box, and it matches this magazine cover. So, okay, let me put those off to the side here. And that's basically it. They gave us a coupon for food. This is like my raffle ticket. I didn't win, but it's okay. So we get $5 off the Swedish food market with a purchase of 25 or more. So that's basically all they gave us today. Now, I was looking for my other Ikea bag from last year so I can show you, but I forgot that I had put things away. So let me see if I can kind of look around the classroom and show you some of the things that we got last year. For starters, they gave us this huge orange Ikea bag filled with stuff last year. This humongous bag. Like right now, it's my document camera because I take it home with me for the summer. And this container full of random things. Oh, these are my cute pens. Okay, so they gave us that bag. And in that bag, they gave us one of these little, they're like candle holders, but you can totally use them for pens and pencils like I have here. So they gave us one of these. These are like $1.99 in their candle section in Ikea. All right, let me look around to see what else. In that bag was also this, whoa, well, that just fell. Um, this big, no, don't fall. Whoops, I was gonna drop my lamp, y'all. And this is a really cute lamp. I got this lamp years ago from Target. Let me just put that there so it doesn't get like hurt or stuff. And I dropped my vacuum cleaner, so let me just put that there. Okay, so like I was saying, they gave us this humongous container, and that just fell. And this is for like your kitchen utensils and stuff, but you can also sort like supplies and things like that. So they gave this to us that was in that bag. They also gave us this cute little stool, and everything that they put in the bag was like $5 or less or something like that. But the one they had modeled for us, because there's a hole right here in the middle, and they had ribbon throughout the whole thing so that you can customize it and make it go with what you're, you're doing in the classroom. They also gave us this set of three cardboard magazine holders, and these were 99 cents for three. And another thing that was in there was this spice rack that is a wooden spice rack. You do have to put it together. I think the hardware comes included in here. I just haven't opened it since last year. I know. But it's really cute because instead of using it for spices, you could also use it like for holding books or displaying books in your classroom. So those are some of the things that were included in our IKEA bag from last year. I'm trying to think if there was something else that was included that I'm not remembering, but yeah, last year's bag was completely different from the bag that we got this year. 
And also last year they had a table set up with all those things and the different ways that you can use them in your classroom so they gave us ideas. And this year I didn't see that there. All right, but at least they gave us some really nice breakfast, which I am really grateful for. And they also gave an opportunity for raffle prizes, which I am very happy for the other teachers that won those raffle prizes, including one of the teachers that was with our little group that I was together with today as soon as I got to Ikea. So I'm very happy for that. Oh, there was another thing, I forgot. There was another thing that they included in the bag and it was this. These little signs, oops, and that one's falling. I'm just dropping everything. These little signs are 99 cents, and that's the stand you screw it in, and is a double-sided picture holder that I actually use for centers. So for example, this is an old one, so like station two, and that's the title of the station, and on the back is the directions for, oops, the glare is real. Okay, let's do it this way. Yeah, the directions for that center. So I love to use these. I also put them up for meet the teacher night or open house for information for parents. And let me just show you. Let me take this out. I'm trying to show you the other ones that I have in here. So, so I can show you how I kind of sort of put them together. So as you can see, this is how I had used them in previous times. So station one, two, three, four, and five. So if you don't have enough space in the classroom, maybe the way your students are grouped with their desk could be a station for rotations or differentiated instruction and whatnot. So our bag from last year contained one of these. I have more because they're only 99 cents and I went back and I got additional ones. Uh, I also have two more in here. So I have a total of eight that are available to me. So yeah, that's another thing that was included in our bag last year. So yeah, I think that basically wraps it. All right, so let me see what else I get done and then I'll sign off. All right, so this is basically where I'm going to finish today's vlog. I hope you enjoy coming along with me to Ikea and to sort of day three of my classroom transformation or day two and a half. I don't know because it wasn't like a full day, but next week I'm gonna to plan to come at least two days to continue setting this up. Hopefully I'll finish off the bulletin boards, get all those things down so I can set up my classroom library area and start putting all the things together in the classroom for my Harry Potter theme. All right, if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit the like button, leave a comment down below, let me know what you thought or any questions you may have. Also, if you haven't subscribed, please consider subscribing and hitting the bell for notifications so you don't miss any future videos. I hope you have a beautiful, magical day, and don't forget to smile. I'll see you next time.